Okay, so today we're doing something completely different, a video I have never made before, something I have never attempted, and I honestly don't know if you guys are gonna love it or if you guys are gonna hate it or what the reaction is gonna be. So please watch the video all the way through. If you think that this is something you wanna see more of, if you like the idea of this series, please hit the like button. I'm not trying to like beg for likes, I'm just saying I really wanna use the like as a gauge of if you guys wanna see more of this or not. And if you guys have any suggestions or if you guys have any like, you know, know feedback on the video please make sure to leave it down in the comments I will be reading comments on this one just to kind of get an idea of what you guys think if the video does well we'll continue to do these if not whatever we tried something new right so this is gonna be something that I've actually had the idea for all the way back dating to MLB 17 I came up with the idea for a series kind of like this but it never really came to fruition I never really got around to making it or knowing how I wanted to do it or whatever and then I told myself when MLB 18 came out I was like I'm gonna do it this year I'm gonna give it a shot never did it 19 is here I gotta at least try it. So what this series is, I think the name I have right now is going to be Market Crashers. And literally the name of the game is it's going to be me versus another content creator. It's gonna be a different guy every single week and it's gonna be a challenge between the two of us of who can make the most amount of stubs on the market in 10 minutes. Today, the guy I'm gonna be facing is gonna be a friend of mine. His name is Kpritz21. He's a smaller MLB YouTuber. I really hope you guys go check out his channel it's linked into the description he's really knowledgeable about the game he makes a lot of debut videos uses a lot of different cards different team builds and stuff like that so I'd appreciate if you guys headed over to his channel and checked out his stuff so in this video it's gonna be me versus K Pritz we both have 10 minutes we have to know our starting stub count and then obviously the stub count at the end of the 10 minutes and whoever ends up making the most amount of stubs in those 10 minutes is the winner for this video so there are a couple little things to clarify when you get started your order screen on the market has to be completely blank you can't have any orders that are sitting there so if you need to sell a card that you're waiting on get that done first but your order screen must be completely blank and then you are only allowed to sell and buy cards that you do in that 10 minute span so you can't go sell like your five duplicate Chris Davis's or your you know duplicate bronzes that you have from a certain team only orders that you get in that 10 minute span so it's gonna be a lot of flipping there's gonna be a lot of interesting decisions are you gonna go for the you know the, the low rated guys and try to get maybe the easier flips or are you gonna take a risk on a higher rated guy or a different type of card to try to get the bigger profit but with the much higher risk so I think this series could have a little bit of potential I think it could be pretty fun to see people's strategies when it comes to flipping cards on the market fast once again I urge you guys if you have any suggestions if you feel like this series could be tweaked or any feedback you have have regarding it at all please leave it down in the comments and I will take it into account and then you know maybe make the series better if it's something you guys want to see continue also let me know what other guys you would like to see face off against me in this market series I think it could be really really fun to get a bunch of people involved and yeah I think this series could have kind of a little bit of potential if it's something we want to continue so here we go guys episode one of market crashers me versus K Pritz 21 who can make the most amount of stubs on the community market in 10 minutes. Enjoy. All right, K Pritz, what is your starting stub count? I'm at 4,000 or 450,555. 450,555. I'm at 107, 573. We have 10 minutes. Whoever makes the most stubs wins. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right, you're getting Get muted and I'm getting going. Get it started. And go all right here we go so i think my um plan of attack right here is to go after orioles live series players more like commons and bronzes and guys like that because i'm trying to find the guys with the biggest gap um so i'm gonna put a couple buy buy orders now for john means 26 i hope this ends up working dude this could end up being completely bad and I could actually lose some stubs out of this 26 26 I'm gonna put in a bunch of buy orders right there and then hopefully be able to sell him for that price but I'm not just gonna focus on one card I'm gonna try to get um, some other cards as well uh, 26 boom finalize order 26 so at first it's gonna look like I'm losing stubs 
but I actually won't be. These are just going to be orders that I'll be able to cancel if they don't end up going through. All right, so I'm going to put in some orders there. So I've got two guys that I'm waiting on. Um, one of the best plans of attack, I think, if you're going for something like this, is just to go after the guys that are on the cheaper collections. At 59, I'm not going to do that. I want to get the lower guys. Like, some of these bronzes and commons would be really good. Let's try Chris Davis. I feel like people may be willing to sell some Chris Davises. Um over here so we're gonna sell that finalize order create barter boom sell boom finalize order and we're only able to like because you guys can see right now i have eight oh i got chris davis there we go i can sell him boom i'm gonna sell him now for 50 stubs that would be a good little flip right there um i'm not able to sell any of the other chris davises that i have like as you guys can see i had like seven or eight of them i'm not gonna you know, sell more of them boom buy order for dan straley completed so i'm gonna try to sell him for 124 now one two four boom how much time do i left dude i'm already two minutes into this are you freaking kidding me oh my god um dan straley i sold who else was going after brandon klein all right we're gonna go ahead and buy or put another buy order in for 11 boom Buy order, 11, boom. Put a couple in there. Let's try uh, Rio Ruiz. Let's see. We're going to buy him for six. Hopefully, he gets sold to me. Buy for six. Boom. Okay. Threw in a couple there. Steve Wilkerson. We're going to go ahead and buy a couple of him for six stubs or five stubs or whatever. Hopefully, if somebody wants to sell him. I'm just literally waiting right now for people to sell me cards. Okay. Brandon Klein. Buy order went through. We're going to go ahead and sell him for 69 Nice. Cool. Okay. Um, I got a bunch of these orders waiting to go right now, dude. A bunch of buy orders. I need these sell orders to go through or else I'm going to end up losing out on some stubs, which I don't want to do. Ooh, look at Matt. Look at this guy. I'm going to try to buy this guy, dude. That would be a good flip right there. Buy him low and then hopefully sell him high if somebody wants to spend 100 stubs on a common card. Let's go ahead and put a couple buy orders in there. Nice. Um, let's try some of these other guys, uh, Josh Lucas, let's see if I can get him, buy him right there, six, six, come on man, I need some, I need some friggin' orders to go through here, somebody needs to be buying some Orioles players right now, cause I'm right now not looking in the best spot, I've only made probably a handful of stubs, and this is not going well, you could try to go for more like silvers and stuff like that, that have higher flips and are a little bit better in terms of what you'd get out of it, but, um, I think it's just the risk is a little bit higher when you're going for guys like that all right so nobody has been buying like any of my freaking cards right now look how many orders i've put up in the last like i don't know what four minutes god dang it all right let's let's go to some of the silvers let's see what some of the silvers are looking like let's try uh um let's try mark trumba i know he's a bronze but let's see if i can maybe get somebody to go ahead and buy my mark trumbo or sell me a mark trumbo um, Jonathan Villar is up there for 970 stubs. Let's move over to the Marlins too while we're waiting and see if maybe I can do something there because the Marlins are another really, really cheap collection. Uh, let's go here. Some of these commons, 69 stubs. I'm going to try to buy at five. Finalize the order. I'm going to try to buy this guy at five. Boom. I should really just focus on each individual guy instead of trying to put multiple guys for one. All right, we're going to try to buy for five. See if that works. We're going to try to buy this guy for five and then try to sell him for a higher price. Come on, man. Dude, literally none of my orders are going through right now. And it's pissing me off. I need somebody to buy some freaking Marlins players, dude. Five. Come on, man. I wonder what Pritz is at right now. I swear if Pritz is already... Oh, there we go. Steve Wilkerson. Which team is he on? I think he's back on the, uh, the Orioles. Ooh, Dan Straley. There we go. There we go. There's a couple. Um, Steve Wilkerson. Where the hell is he? There he is. So we bought him for cheap. We're going to go ahead and sell him, hopefully, for 52. What was the other one that just got completed? Uh, completed orders. Dan Straley. I bought him for 26. Where's Dan Straley? There he is. Oh, if we could sell him, this would be a big one. We could sell him for 122. Come on, somebody needs to buy him. Okay, Yadiel Rivera was just bought for five. What team is that guy on? I think that guy might be on the Marlins. Let's go find out. Yadiel Rivera. There he is. Perfect. We're going to try to sell him for 63 stubs. This is the move, man. Just focus on one order, like, at a time, kind of. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't put multiple, order, multiple orders in for one guy. So hopefully we'll be able to get something good out of there. Um, buy order for Rio Ruiz. Where's Rio Ruiz? He's on the Orioles, right? Yeah, he's got to be on 
Baltimore. Rio Ruiz, where is he? Boom. We could so, uh, hopefully sell him for 47 stubs. I'm getting my buy orders to go through, but I need somebody to actually, like... Or I'm getting my sell orders? Or no, buy orders to go through, but I need people to, to buy the ones I'm selling. That's the biggest thing right now. Um, so I need these four guys to sell. I'm kind of waiting on these. I'm going to go ahead and cancel a couple orders here. Um, um, buy order for Mark Trumbo! Wait. Did I... So I, I, yeah, okay, Chris Davis. I think I'm good. I might I was just tripping right there. Where's Chris Davis at? There he is. I can sell Chris Davis now for 49 stubs. Or no, he's still 50. I haven't sold my other Chris Davis yet. Oh my god, this is actually turning out bad. I, I literally have three and a half minutes, and people are not doing this. I'm going to go ahead and cancel some of these buy orders I made. Buy order for Brandon Klein. Where's Brandon Klein? All right, hopefully I can, uh, wait, what did that one say? Was that a... Okay, that was a buy order. Nice. So I can go ahead and sell him now for 67 stubs. Nice. Okay. Let's go to Mark Trumbo. Um, Mark Trumbo I bought for 102, so I need to go ahead and try to sell him for 218 now. I'm trying to flip these cards. I'm just not getting anybody to buy my cards, bro. I might end up with a negative stub count. There we go. Mark Trumbo sold. That's a big one right there. All right, I'm going to cancel this John Means. I'm going to cancel a Dan Straley. I'm going to cancel... This uh, Chris Davis right here. Um, I'm gonna cancel. Uh, who should I cancel? I'm gonna cancel a couple Wotherspoons. Okay. I'm gonna cancel a couple Josh Lucases. Buy order for Steve Wilkerson completed. Where is Steve Wilkerson? Where is he? There he is. Okay, so I'm gonna try to sell him for 49. I might be undercutting myself right here, honestly. I have two minutes left, dude. Two minutes left. This is looking crazy. All right, I've got these ones I'm waiting to sell. Okay, I sold him for 44. Chad Wallach, Ben Meyer, Brett Graves. I'm going to cancel a couple Evan Phillips and some Josh Lucases. Okay, cancel that. Um... Cancel another Josh Lucas. Cancel another Evan Phillips. So now I'm pretty much just got, like... All of these guys I'm waiting on. Brandon Klein. I might go ahead and cancel that order right there. Um, I'm going to go ahead and... I'm pretty much going to cancel any buy orders I have at this point and just wait for these guys to sell. Dan Straley, I'm going to cancel. I got a minute and 40 seconds left. I'm going to cancel this Rio Ruiz buy order. Matt Witherspoon, I'm going to cancel. Josh Lucas, I'm going to cancel. And I'm literally just waiting for all of these sell orders to go through. With my time limit, I can't risk buying and selling other cards. Mark Trumbo flipped pretty quickly, so that was a good one. But once all of these go through, then I should be good. I don't know how many stubs this is going to get me, but I need these orders. I have a minute for some of these orders to go through, bro. It's literally a waiting game at this point. Let me make sure I'm still the highest one. Brandon Klein at 67. I'm still the highest one. Chris Davis at 50. I'm not the highest on Chris Davis yet. Oh, God. I got to cancel Chris Davis and sell him for a lower price. 45. We're going to go ahead for 44. Come on, man. I have less than a minute. Oh, my God. This is actually kind of intense. Uh, Chris Davis canceled that one, too, and put him up for 44 again. Create sell for 44. Finalize order. Okay. Um, Dan Straley trying to sell him for 124. He got undercut as well. So we're going to go ahead and try to sell him for 119. Come on, dude. 30 seconds. Somebody buy my Chris Davises, please. I'm about to freaking lose stubs on this probably. Oh, my God. This is about to be an embarrassing video. Brandon Klein at 69. He's not even the highest anymore. Oh, my God. This sucks. Uh, 64. I have 20 seconds, dude. I'm actually going to freaking... I'm probably going to end up with a negative stub count, bro. Oh, my God. What the hell? Uh, Brandon Klein, I got to cancel this one. 10 seconds. Literally, nobody is buying Orioles players right now. I just freaking choked, dude. I thought that I was going to take the easy route. That's it. I lost. Uh, there's no way. All right, I got to cancel all of these. I got to bite the bullet on all of these cards that didn't end up selling, man. Oh, that sucks. So I finished at 107.602. Did I even make stubs out of that or did I lose stubs? What was my starting stub count? I forgot. Uh, it was uh, 107.573. I made... <laughs> I made 29 stubs. <laughs> 
Bro, I just didn't get lucky at all. I thought the Orioles and the Marlins would have been the way to go because I thought people would be buying those because they're cheap collections that people want to do. Maybe we're not doing it at a good time. We're doing it at 1230 on a Tuesday, so maybe that has something to do with it. But let's see what Pritz says. All right, Pritz, how did it, uh, <laughs> how'd it go for you? Um... <laughs> <laughs> I think I failed. Yeah, I think I kind of took an L too. Nobody was buying anything, man. I took I took a big loss. I took a big risk. I got a I got a diamond equipment, and I couldn't sell it. Oh my god, you actually went for the big guns, dude. I, I went for the big one, dude. Uh, I was going. I went for Orioles and Marlins bronze. I was doing Orioles too. You were the one messing me up. <laughs> was I undercutting you? <laughs> yeah, you bum. So what was your final count? How much did you lose? I lost 1,635. <laughs> I I made uh I made 29 stubs. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, oh, man. we got big spenders on this, man. All right, so uh, you lost. So that means we got to go buy five packs on the pack store, and then uh, whichever highest overall cards you pull, you got to quick sell it. I don't care if it's a diamond, you got to quick sell it. All right. All right, as long Let's as go. I don't pull a trap, I'm good. All right, All right, got my five packs. All right, ready when you are. All right, three, two, one. First pack. Let's see. I'm going to see it pack. pop up in the right if you actually pull something, too. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I got bronze players. I got a silver. Nothing I got a right freaking there. Orioles silver, too. Sick. <laughs> Thanks, bro. Thanks for Jonathan Villar. All right, next pack. All right, Let's next see. Next pack. Let's get it. Come on. Come on. Please give him a diamond. All right, I got a bronze. Right, still, still bronze players. We good. <laughs> you're, you're lucking out. <laughs> All right. I, I don't got good pack. Like this is not the time to give it to me. <laughs> I got right, a silver no. player. Uh oh. Let's see. Leclerc. I'm yeah. fine with quick selling him. Yep. All right, two packs left. Come on, give. Oh, I got a gold. What is that? I got a gold nameplate. Got um, more bronze players. Marco Estrada. All right, last pack. Last pack it is. Here we go. Come on, give him a diamond, uh, please. Oh, no, nothing good right there. Oh, oh I got uh, a gold. Let's go. Was the <laughs> You're excited for a gold. I got Joey oh, Votto. Man. That's a good gold. Uh, yeah, that, that's pretty good right there. And Adam Duvall. All, All right, right, so. I guess we quick sell in the clerk. <laughs> yeah, let him go, dude. Let him go into the wild. I know you're really hung up <laughs> on a, that that's one. That's a tough loss right there. <laughs> All right, well. Ranger. What does he even go for? Like 200. 200. Damn, bro. You're really letting a big one out tough one for the no money spent all right man well thank you for joining me Pritch's channel is obviously linked in the description of this video if you guys want to go check them out but thank you very much for watching if you enjoyed the video hit the thumbs up button subscribe to the channel if you are new and i will see you guys in the next one peace